Naraka, Sanskrit, Naraka, Pali, Naraya, Naraya is a term in Buddhist cosmology usually referred to in English as hell or hell realm or purgatory. The Narakas of Buddhism are closely related to Diyu, the hell in Chinese mythology. A Naraka differs from the hell of Christianity in two respects. Firstly, beings are not sent to Naraka as the result of a divine judgment or punishment, and secondly, the length of a being's stay in a Naraka is not eternal, though it is usually incomprehensibly long, from hundreds of millions to quintillions of years. A being is born into a Naraka as a direct result of his or her accumulated actions karma and resides there for a finite period of time until that karma has achieved its full result. After his or her karma is used up, he or she will be reborn in one of the higher worlds as the result of karma that had not yet ripened. In the Devaduta Sutta, the 130th Discourse of Majjhima Nikaya, the Buddha teaches about hell in vivid detail. Physically, Narakas are thought of as a series of cavernous layers which extend below Jambudvipa the ordinary human world into the earth. There are several schemes for enumerating these Narakas and describing their torments. The Abhidharma Kosa, treasure house of higher knowledge, is the root text that describes the most common scheme as the eight cold narakas and eight hot narakas. Topic: <laughs> Cold narakas. Arbuda e bu tuo the blister. Naraka is a dark frozen plain surrounded by icy mountains and continually swept by blizzards. Inhabitants of this world arise fully grown and abide lifelong naked and alone, while the cold raises blisters upon their bodies. The length of life in this naraka is said to be the time it would take to empty a barrel of sesame seeds if one only took out a single seed every hundred years. Life in this naraka is two times 1,012 years long. Nararbuddha, si bu tuo the burst blister. Naraka, is even colder than Arbuddha. There, the blisters burst open, leaving the beings' bodies covered with frozen blood and pus. Life in this naraka is four times 1,013 years long. Atata e ting tuo is the shivering naraka. There, beings shiver in the cold, making an at at sound with their mouths. Life in this naraka is eight times 1,014 years long. Hahava, huo huo po winking face, is the lamentation naraka. There, the beings lament in the cold, going ha, ha in pain. Life in this naraka is 1.6 times 1,016 years long. Huhuva, hu, po the chattering teeth. Naraka, is where beings shiver as their teeth chatter, making the sound hu, hu. Life in this naraka is 3.2 times 1,017 years long. Utpala, wa bo luo is the blue lotus. Naraka. The intense cold there makes the skin turn blue like the color of an Utpala water lily. Life in this naraka is 6.4 times 1,018 years long. Padma, bo te mo the lotus naraka, has blizzards that crack open frozen skin, leaving one raw and bloody. Life in this naraka is 1.28 times 1,020 years long. Mahapama, mo he bo te mo is the great lotus naraka. The entire body cracks into pieces and the internal organs are exposed to the cold, also cracking. Life in this naraka is 2.56 times 1,021 years long. Each lifetime in these narakas is 20 times the length of the one before it. <laughs> Hot narakas Sanjiva, Danghuo the reviving. Naraka, has ground made of hot iron heated by an immense fire. Beings in this naraka appear fully grown, already in a state of fear and misery. As soon as the being begins to fear being harmed by others, their fellows appear and attack each other with iron claws and hell guards appear and attack the being with fiery weapons. As soon as the being experiences an unconsciousness like death, they are suddenly restored to full health and the attacks begin again. Other tortures experienced in this naraka include, having molten metal dropped upon them, being sliced into pieces, and suffering from the heat of the iron ground. Life in this naraka is 1.62 times 1,012 years long. It is said to be 1,000 yojanas beneath Jambudvipa and 10,000 yojanas in each direction a yojana being 7 miles, or 11 kilometers. Kalasutra, Hei Sheung the Black Thread 
Naraka, includes the torments of Sanjeeva. In addition, black lines are drawn upon the body, which hell guards use as guides to cut the beings with fiery saws and sharp axes. Life in this Naraka is 1.296 times 1,013 years long. Samgata, Zhang He the crushing. Naraka, is surrounded by huge masses of rock that smash together and crush the beings to a bloody jelly. When the rocks move apart again, life is restored to the being and the process starts again. Life in this Naraka is 1.0368 times 1014 years long. Raurava, Zhao Huan the screaming Naraka, is where beings run wildly about, looking for refuge from the burning ground. When they find an apparent shelter, they are locked inside it as it blazes around them, while they scream inside. Life in this Naraka is 8.2944 times 1014 years long. Maharava, Da Jiao Huan the Great Screaming Naraka, is similar to Raurava. Punishment here is for people who maintain their own body by hurting others. In this hell, Ruru animals known as Kravyata torment them and eat their flesh. Life in this Naraka is 6.63552 times 1,015 years long. Tapana, Jiao Ri Yan Ri is the heating Naraka, where hell guards impale beings on a fiery spear until flames issue from their noses and mouths. Life in this Naraka is 5.308416 times 1,016 years long. Pratapana, Da Jiao Ri Da Yan Ri the great heating Naraka. The tortures here are similar to the Tapana Naraka, but the beings are pierced more bloodily with a trident. Life in this Naraka is 4.2467328 times 1017 years long. It is also said to last for the length of half an Antarakalpa. Avici, Abai Wu Jian is the uninterrupted Naraka. Beings are roasted in an immense blazing oven with terrible suffering. Life in this Naraka is 3.39738624 times 1,018 years long. It is also said to last for the length of an Antarakalpa. Each lifetime in these Narakas is eight times the length of the one before it. Some sources describe 500 or even hundreds of thousands of different Narakas. The sufferings of the dwellers in Naraka often resemble those of the Pratas, and the two types of being are easily confused. The simplest distinction is that beings in Naraka are confined to their subterranean world, while the Pratas are free to move about. There are also isolated and boundary hells called Pratyeka Narakas Pali, Pacheka Naraya and Lokantarikas. In Buddhist literature The Durga Gama or Longer Agama Sutra ch. Chang a Han Jing Zhang a Han Jing, was translated to Chinese in 22 fascicles from an Indic original by Buddhiyasas and Zhu Fonian Zhu Fu Nian in 412 13 CE. This literature contains 30 discrete scriptures in four groups. Vargas. The fourth Varga, which pertains to Buddhist cosmology, contains a chapter on hell. Do you pin do you pin within the scripture of the account of the world Shi Ji Jing Shi Ji Jing. In this text, the Buddha describes to the Sangha each of the hells in great detail, beginning with their physical location and names. Fu Gao Bai Chu Si Si Tian Sha Yu Ba Qian Tian Sha Wai Rao Qi Wai Fu Yu Da Hai Shui Zhou Za Wai Rao Ba Qian Tian Sha Fu Yu Da Jin Gang Shan Rao Da Hai Shui Jin Gang Shan Wai Fu Yu Di Er Da Jin Gang Shan Er Shan Zhang Jian Yao Yao Ming Ming Ri Yu Shen Tian Yu Da Wei Li Bu Nen Yi Guang Zhao Ji Yu Bai Bai Yu Ba Da Di Yu Qi Yi Di Yu Yu Shi Lu Shao Di Yu Di Yi Da Di Yu Ming Shang Di Er Ming He Sheung Di San Ming Dui Ya Di Si Ming Zhao Huan Di Wu Ming Da Zhao Huan Di Lu Ming Shao Ji Di Qi Ming Da Shao Ji Di Ba Ming Wu Jian Qi Shang Di Yu Yu Shi Lu Shao Yu Shao Yu Zong Guang Wu Bai Yu Shuan Di Yi Shao Yu Ming Yu He Sha Er Ming Fei Shi San Ming Wu Bai Ding Si Ming Ji Wu Ming Ke Lu Ming Yi Tong Fu Qi Ming Duo Tong Fu Ba 
ming shi mo ju ming nong shui shi ming liang huo shi yi ming wei he shi er ming tai wan shi san ming jin fu shi si ming chai lang shi wu ming jian shu shi lu ming han bing The Buddha told the bhikkhus, there are 8,000 continents surrounding the four continents on earth. There is, moreover, a great sea surrounding those 8,000 continents. There is, moreover, a great diamond mountain range encircling that great sea. Beyond this great diamond mountain range is yet another great diamond mountain range. And between the two mountain ranges lies darkness. The sun and moon in the divine sky with their great power are unable to reach that darkness with their light. In that space between the two diamond mountain ranges there are eight major hells. Along with each major hell are sixteen smaller hells. The first major hell is called thoughts. The second is called black rope. The third is called crushing. The fourth is called moaning. The fifth is called great moaning. The sixth is called burning. The seventh is called great burning. The eighth is called unremitting. The hell of thoughts contains sixteen smaller hells. The smaller hells are five hundred square yojana in area. The first small hell is called black sand. The second hell is called boiling excrement. The third is called five hundred nails. The fourth is called hunger. The fifth is called thirst. The sixth is called single copper cauldron. The seventh is called many copper cauldrons. The eighth is called stone pestle. The ninth is called pus and blood. The tenth is called measuring fire. The eleventh is called ash river. The twelfth is called iron pellets. The thirteenth is called axes and hatchets. The fourteenth is called jackals and wolves. The fifteenth is called sword cuts. The sixteenth is called cold and ice. Further evidence supporting the importance of these texts discussing hells lies in Buddhists' further investigation of the nature of hell and its denizens. Buddhaverman's 5th century Chinese translation of the Abhidharma Vibhasa Sastra ch. Apadamo Piposha Luna Pi Tan Pi Posha Lun questions whether hell wardens who torture hell beings are themselves sentient beings, what form they take, and what language they speak. Xuanzang's Zan Zhang 7th century Chinese translation of the Abhidharmakosa Sastra ch. Apadamo Juxie Luna Pi Da Mo Juxie Lun too is concerned with whether hell wardens are sentient beings, as well as how they go on to receive karmic retribution, whether they create bad karma at all, and why are they not physically affected and burned by the fires of hell. Descriptions of the Narakas are a common subject in some forms of Buddhist commentary and popular literature as cautionary tales against the fate that befalls evildoers and an encouragement to virtue. The Mahayana Sutra of the Bodhisattva Saitagarbha graphically describes the sufferings in Naraka and explains how ordinary people can transfer merit in order to relieve the sufferings of the beings there. The Japanese monk Genshin began his Ohoyoshu with a description of the suffering in Naraka. Tibetan Lamrim texts also included a similar description. Chinese Buddhist texts considerably enlarged upon the description of Naraka diyu, detailing additional Narakas and their punishments, and expanding the role of Yama and his helpers, Ox Head and Horse Face. In these texts, Naraka became an integral part of the otherworldly bureaucracy which mirrored the imperial Chinese administration. Gallery See also Bon Festival Do you Ghost Festival Hell Money Saitagarbha Madgalyayana Ox Head and Horse Face Alambana Sutra Yama East Asia Topic Notes Topic. Further reading Matsunaga, Alicia, Matsunaga, Daigon The Buddhist Concept of Hell. New York, Philosophical Library. Tyser, Stephen F. Having Once Died and Returned to Life. Representations of Hell in Medieval China. Harvard Journal of Asiatic Studies. 48 433-464. Law, Bimala Churn, Barua, Beni Madab 
Heaven and Hell in Buddhist Perspective. Varanasi, Bhartiya Pub. House. External links http colon slash slash net slash doctrine underscore hells dot htm http colon slash slash vatabase dot net slash sb slash three slash thirty slash twenty five slash n http colon slash slash srimadbagavadam dot org slash conto five slash chapter twenty six html the thirty one planes of existence the Asian Classics Institute course on death and the realms of existence.